What's up, YouTube? This is Quinn from Quinn Essentials, and today I want to talk to you about, uh, you know, how to make your rental application more attractive. Now, one of the big things here, you know, probably the single best thing that you can do is if you are planning on staying in the place longer than two years, offer that. Offer that that I will sign a two-year lease. That is huge because if you have a yearly turnover as a landlord, there's a lot of expenses associated with that. The landlord's going to go in; they're going to clean up the property, granted, if they're good landlords, they're going to clean up the property, they're going to, you know, address any wear and tear, anything, any issues that, you know, they weren't informed about, and they're going to be sitting vacant, which means that they're not making any money. So to them, it's very important to have fewer turnovers. So they're going to, a good landlord is going to try and keep a tenant in there as long as they possibly can. So offer that two-year lease. You know, most people are going to be coming in with a one-year lease because they're scared about binding themselves to a longer commitment. There are ways that you can work with your landlord. You know, you can you can end a lease if both parties agree to it or the lease terms are broken. Um, typically, you know, good tenant, good landlord, those lease terms won't be broken. Um, so you can reach an agreement with your landlord typically. Your next best option is offering uh, multiple months paid. So say you are taking that two year lease, listen, I'll pay the first year up front. Or if you're taking a one year lease, I'll pay, uh, you know, three, six, nine months up front, right? Whatever you have available that's not going to put you in financial trouble. When you make those types of offers, you know, the landlord's gonna look at it and be like, awesome, you know, that's, that's just gonna make you so much more attractive uh, it's going to give you a higher likelihood. I know this market, the rental market especially, uh, is booming. You know, I, I was working with somebody and, you know, we put in a, they unfortunately couldn't take longer than a year lease. They uh, are planning to build a home. We put in a full offer. You know, we, we were willing to pay everything up front. Uh, you know, no problems with it. We had over three times the income. Just, it, I mean, it, it was a beautiful, beautiful offer. But the fact that we couldn't extend the lease means that we got outbid. So when we, uh, the person that did get the lease, I did reach out and ask, or not to the person that got the lease, but the, the agent. And uh, you know, I reached out and said, why didn't we get it? And, uh, you know, it, it, it ended up being, you know, somebody was willing to sign a three-year lease. That is your single best bargaining chip. Your next best would be offering more upfront um, and I know that gets expensive because you have your security deposit, uh, but that money never goes away as long as you take care of the place, right? Um, as long as uh, you have your upfront deposit, pet deposits, whatever you know that landlord in particular is asking for, it gets expensive real quick. Um, but the more time that you can put up for, so three, six, nine, twelve months, uh, that'll help you a lot. Now, I hope you guys find some uh, rentals in this market. If you have any questions, you can reach me at the email right here. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe. Hit that little bell icon at the bottom, and we'll see you next time.